How's it going guys? It's Poetry Set and welcome back to an episode of the Mawar, Mawar Never Changes campaign in uh, your Universe Sounds 4 with the new Dharma expansion where we are continuing on here. Um, we just got out of that brutal coalition war, lost a good chunk of our country, but um, I mean, we're going to get it back eventually. <laughs> um, we are going to be screwed for a while. We are bankrupt, so I'm probably just going to go up to speed 5, but before we do that, I'm going to try to get like a couple more allies or something. Just just anything to anything to buffer our position up a bit. Um, who would be closest to giving us an alliance? Not many people, huh? Maybe Chanda. They are Hindu, so they like us a little more. Jalanpur is actually getting to starting to be terrifying. Um, they're going to be the biggest issue later on. But we have Vajrayanagar, and we'll use them against Jumper and then backstab both of them. So <laughs> that's the idea. Let's go up to speed 5. We're earning money now, at least. We, we have new loans, even though we already went bankrupt. <laughs> because why wouldn't we? Hmm. Um. Yeah. Hmm, that's a lovely amount of manpower. Um, yeah, I mean, so we're... We're just gonna sit here and wait a while. <laughs> Keep our alliance strong, hopefully, and survive to live in, you know, live another day. Very nice, 20 prestige. I mean, we're at negative 73 prestige. Also, zero legitimacy. Didn't realize that. Makes sense, though. It's mostly because we have a regency, but then also the prestige. When our dude comes... To, ooh, yeah, Delhi's ripped. Um... We'll come to the throne in like a year, so that's good. When do we come to the throne? We just came to the throne, which put our um, legitimacy up to 99 again, which is very helpful. That's the first step. We have a 555 five, five now, so we might be able to start doing this better. <laughs> um, this, hopefully this ruler lasts a long time. We get to select a deity. Our deity will be... Trade efficiency, national tax, my fire, just gotta be. We probably need to re-up our royal marriage. No, we don't. What about with Koch? No. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, government reforms. We get one... It's going to take a while because we have a lot of autonomy. <laughs> Ooh. Hmm. How much are we... Each of our loans are for 82, really, and we have six of them. Yeah. 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 I'm going to do that. We're just going to kind of have to sit on those <laughs> the loans and deal with it. Um, oh, yeah, luckily, apparently, stability cost is not... Uh, Affected by <laughs> bankruptcy. That's good. Good to know. Mawat Dakota Dundar. Dundar, yeah, rip Dundar. We have cores on that too, which is nice, so. Uh yeah, we can't do any conquests or anything. We just kinda we just kinda have to sit here for right now. No no choice basically. We are halfway through the uh, bankruptcy, basically. Oh, whoa! Jean Pur, uh formed Delhi, actually. Huh, formed like the Kingdom of Delhi or whatever. Since it has like historical borders or whatever. Yeah, more prestige hitting events. Thank you, game. That's very, very much appreciated. Ask for contribution, please. <laughs> very, very much please and thank you. Hmm. Okay, we're at least making a little more money now. Yeah, our income is slowly, slowly climbing. We can repay one loan. That brings our income up by another half a ducat. <laughs> well, it means we'll pay the next one off about 25% quicker. One step. One step at a time. One step at a frickin' time. Hmm... Okay, yeah, Mawat did conquer them there. 
Um, we can enact a government reform. Cool. So we are at the next level, I guess, right? Because you you can change, but it adds corruption, and that kind of sucks. Um, we're not going to do that. So what do we do? Decentralized bureaucracy or centralized bureaucracy? Uh, I, monthly autonomy change is good. And actually, what is our autonomy like? I mean, our lowest is 36. That could be really good, but it does go down over time anyway. So I don't think it's actually worth it. And um, Max Promoted Cultures, I think, is really good. So I'm going to do that instead. Okay, what about the next level? Let's start looking ahead, thinking ahead. It's going to be a while. Advisor costs. Leader costs. Administrative free policies. That's definitely what I want to be doing. <laughs> The other one's selling actually pretty bad. The reforms seem cool enough. Like, it's, it's just free stuff you get over time. But they're not, like, none of them are that powerful, it doesn't seem to me. I mean, well, no. Max Promoted Cultures 2 is actually pretty powerful. But some of the other ones, National Manpower Modifier, I guess, is good. Yearly Average Tradition plus 0.5 is all right. But, like, I don't know. Some of them are just not great. So I would like to ally them, but they're getting beat up now. So maybe not. <laughs> Mal was one province, though. That brings me brings me joy. Five zero zero one or five zero one. Sorry, I want to get rid of him, but I can't yet. <laughs> oh man. I mean, we're just yeah, we're just gonna be sitting here. How much longer are we uh, bankrupted for? Oh, we're no longer bankrupt. No wonder uh, stuff is looking more normal now. I'm gonna lose. No, I'm not gonna lose stability. I, who am I kidding? Hmm. Okay. Yeah, we're just going to sit here a little while longer. Quite a while longer. <laughs> Please tell me you're only allied to one person. So Baglana as well. Baglana, no problem. That actually seems all right. I can do that. Not right now, but eventually I can do that. So I would like to get all these guys above above this percentage, you know. Okay. There we go. Cool. I got you all above the marks that I wanted. Cool. Power. <laughs> We're way behind in Diplo. Jeez. That's brutal, man. That's brutal. Hmm. Batiana, we lost our claim. Where is that? I don't know. A royal marriage with them ended again. Just now. Still, I'm fine with that. Alright, so now we're making five and a half ducats a month. Quite a bit more. Hopefully gonna be able to keep pace with stuff. I'm going to recruit a general again. Good general. Good general. We have two good generals now. So that's good. That's good. I like doing those options whenever you get a chance. That way you can have a uh, extra general sitting around. You know. Might as well have that on cooldown. Okay. So our plan currently, I think, is to declare on Jun Junigar. Destroy their allies, then destroy them. Oh, hey, a royal marriage with them just ended, too, so that's good. Uh, absolutely take money. I know our prestige is actually awful, which is going to make a decent difference in battles, but still. 
It's not the priority right now. Money, getting out of debt is the priority. Hmm. Okay. Honestly, oh man, the Renaissance actually gonna take forever to get here. So probably gonna have to develop develop it here. Um, we have to keep up on military tech though. That's not a negotiable thing. We just have to do that. Because otherwise we will we'll die. Hmm. I mean, man, we might as well. It's. I mean, that's not. It's gonna take actually forever to get even one additional claim. Hold on, take that. Maybe take this one too. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like that's actually all right. That way we can at least have an idea group to do stuff with. That brings us up uh, to, yeah, okay, cool. So we probably want an administrative idea. Influence could be good, but I think we do it. Also, like, think about it like this. So culture group-wise, um, actually, like, a third of India is in our culture group. So none of that we need promoted cultures for. And a lot of it, the other stuff, there's too much of to even really be realistic that we're going to get it. So like we'll probably do Canada and the and the Dravidian group, and then maybe like Punjabi and what is this, Gondi and uh, and maybe Bengali, and that'll be like all the cultures we have, and we have enough spaces for that. Maybe Baluchi on the other side or Afghan or Persian, um, that'll be good. Hmm, <clears throat> I think so. I don't think we want humanist really humanist can be good as well for like tolerance and stuff but most of the stuff here is already hindu even if it's ruled by uh, by muslim nations so i feel like instead i mean religious eventually maybe once we own all of india because that's the only hindu place in the world except for down uh, in indonesia as well still um so that would be you know something to consider but maybe then so maybe religious later on but I i'm probably not going to be doing colonization this game not something i'm interested in uh, per se um, but I do think, I think administrative basically is what I'm trying to say. We're going to be using mercs in the future, I think. Well, there's no way around it, so let's do it. Okay. Mm hmm. So, I mean, I'm, yeah, I'm just going to keep going to speed five because we are just trying to pay off our loans. These loans are, uh, cheaper, huh? Hmm. Did I get, hold on, I have a claim here. Yeah, good. Yeah. I'll do that. Okay. Hmm. All of our allies, or all of our enemies are allied against us. It's very annoying. Yeah, it's gonna be tough. Gujarat, Baglana, and Sumer. You're probably the weakest. You're still not too weak. How do we even have 34 power projection at all from Malwa? Okay, that makes sense. Hmm. We have one loan left. Look at that. Hmm. Yeah, Gujarat, we cannot attack right now. But we can get to them through Mawat. That's probably what I'm going to have to do. Will, will Bengal ally us now? No, but it's not ridiculous that they would consider it. Okay. Hmm. Can't believe Bamanis is still actually surviving and managing to get a little further down there. Hmm. No, I can't do that. Oh, man, this is tough. What about Afghanistan? Maybe they will ally us. We'll see. Hmm. 
Okay. Um... One more month, we should be able to pay it off, right? I think that's right. No, a couple more. <laughs> I'm gonna slow down now, though. Let's get to the point where we can uh, <laughs> start doing things again. We've spent about 10 years recovering from that. Jeez. Oh, Delhi's actually losing a war against a bunch of the Tibetan like miners. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, our truce with Malwa has just ended, actually. That's funny. Multan and Nogar. Okay. Hmm. That could be good, maybe. I think Junagar is our best bet, though. I think that's who we want to attack. And we can't even do that yet, because we need... We need, uh... <laughs> we need money and we need troops. Oh, hey, we can do this again. Oh, unfortunately, we only got one additional one. I didn't pay enough attention, I guess. I, uh, oh, you know what? Yeah, it only does one per province. Like, they're matched. It, you can't go over that, even if you... Yeah, never mind. I did that wrong. Hmm. We can build cannons now. We should do that. At least get something building so our manpower can recover. And we get, we're not wasting our pool. Hey, nice. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Man, uh, we are all severely weakened after all that war. Yeah, I mean, I think our best bet is going to be go after... Oh, what about Hormuz? Will you ally me? Hormuz? Hmm. I think I'm going to do this. I'm going to hire an advisor. Oh, that's a rip. <laughs> National tax modifier down is really annoying. Especially since we've already had more than enough issues with that. Hmm. Okay. So, I mean, we could call in our ally. We have enough favors of them, correct? Yeah. I don't know, man. I think I'm going to wait on that. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna hire any more right now. Any more other advisors. Just get some of the more expensive troops first. Yeah, building up slowly. Actually, yeah, we, we don't have that much of a force limit anyway, so. Oh no. Oh, this is real bad. <laughs> oh no. 33% local autonomy? You gotta be kidding me. That's lame. It's a lot of local autonomy. Let's watch our income plummet for that. Yeah, we lost like a good chunk of our income. Huh. I think I'm just gonna do two more infantry. Still no one else will ally us. Oh, we pissed people off that much. Hmm. 
Yeah, I feel like this is going to be our war. Just get a couple little provinces and a little powers of some minor powers out of the way. I will actually pay for that. Yeah, we need prestige. <laughs> a lot of it. Okay, we're going to come down here. Yeah. And we're going to go to go to war here in a second. Bring this back up. Yeah, we're going to go to war with you. You're allied with Baglana and Jal Jalavad. And then we'll, uh, once we own both of those, we'll have a little more power. You know, and just snowball. That's the idea. A little bit at a time. A little bit at a time. Baglana's a good province. It's, uh... It's Marathi, which is in our culture group, so it's a large culture. Huh, okay. Definitely make sure to declare on the right one. Alright, let's go ahead and, uh... Smash! I'm not actually gonna do, uh... War taxes this time. Okay, so there's that. That's what I wanted to see. And we chase them down before they can escape. There we go. It looks like that's going to work out. There we go. Smash the little guys. Take two of these. Okay. And now we come back up here. <laughs> and we deal with Baglana. Okay, and our vassal will start recruiting things. That's good. Yeah, I don't like this whole sieging me down thing. I don't appreciate that. She, I don't appreciate it there. Because now they're going to start recruiting stuff. Hmm. And I'm also worried that they're, but I'm, yeah, I'm also worried that they're gonna go down there though. Yeah, that's what they're doing. You sneaky, sneaky jerks. See what we can do. Um, yeah, I suppose we work on taking these guys out one at a time. We have two generals that have siege, don't we? We got to get Buglana out of it. I'm, I'm actually probably most worried about them. Okay, 22nd of October, 31st. We can make it to the 31st, right? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. All right, well, we won anyways. We actually stack wiped them even. Ooh, hold on. Wait, we stack wiped them. Hold on, don't do that. Silly poetry. There you go, do that. Then go down there. Quick, quick, quick. We have limited time. Okay. Yeah, go down there. Okay. Yeah, quickly. Quickly now. I don't care if we lose some troops, actually. I just need to kill them. Kill, kill, kill. Squish, squish, squish. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter where you go. You go there. Cool. Squish, more squish. Go there. Squish, squish, squish. Oh no, this is a problem. 
Oh, they just have... No, they just have too many things. <laughs> it's like stomping. It's like whack-a-mole or something, right? I'm just trying to... Siege down everything at once. Okay, that's good. Our vassal might win that battle. They're gonna win. Not sure where that army's gonna retreat to. Somewhere. That's for sure. Okay. Oh, they are retreated right next to there. Oh, you can handle it. You can handle it. Okay. It is, it's like a game of whack-a-mole that we're doing here. Okay, we've done it. We won the game of whack-a-mole, nice. Okay, that's good. Um, now we will start to siege everything. All right, cool, nice. Um, hold on, you get the other siege general. We have two siege generals, it's just, I couldn't really maneuver them around effectively at the time. Uh, yeah, do the palace again, nice. Took a loan again, not good. Okay. Yeah, I mean, we kind of just gotta wait here. So would Hormuz actually ally me? Oh, they would, pretty much. We could probably get it at least, yeah. And once we're out of war, we might be able to ally them. Hmm, okay. What is Circus expansion like? Yeah, it's still kind of nasty, so we gotta be careful with how much we take. But it's all... These are all Hindu countries, actually, so it shouldn't be as important to the, uh, the Sultanates around. Uh, after we finish this war up, which won't take much longer again, you know, I'm gonna have to end this episode. I already went over on time a little bit, but so. Gujarat declared on Bamanis. Okay, interesting. That's fine. I would rather Gujarat not get stronger, but not much I can do about it right now. Okay. Oh, we actually still don't have enough, do we? Yeah. Hmm. Hold on. Because that's a three, a level three. Yeah, that makes sense. That's why. Hmm. All right, let's go over here. Besieging these. Nice. Might as well go over there. Cool. Um, if we tell them to attach, we will have enough. Yeah, okay, cool. Can we pay off that loan? No, not yet. Can we ask for a contribution? We can. Limited war support? I'm gonna do that as well. It's gonna, uh, this war's gonna take a little longer, so might as well. Cool. We're making decent money now. Doing all right. No longer at the brink of destruction like our country was before. So Baglana, I even if we can only take the one permanent claim, I, st I think I'm okay with that. Oh, no, you know what? That doesn't. That makes hardly any difference. So absolutely, I'm going to do that. <clears throat> absolutely, I'm going to wait for all that. You know what I need to do? I just need to take the cannons. Okay, hold on. No longer attached, please. Cool. Hmm... Now we're just gonna survive for now. It's almost 1500, but that's not, in the grand scheme of things, it's not, you know, too much time has passed. So we still have plenty of time to turn things around for us, I think. We're doing all right. You know, we have expanded since the beginning of the game, pretty sure. <laughs> Although we did lose two provinces that we owned originally. Hmm. So I'm gonna feed some stuff here to Kutch. This is part of the... Yeah, I'm gonna feed all this stuff here to them. I don't have any claims, though. Hmm. Yeah, but I think that's okay. I still want to split up the points. Even though I have a lot of admin, though. Hmm, you know what? I'm not sure. Not sure. You know, not really sure. So I think this one, I'm gonna take both, yeah. 
take all their money. Good, get out of there. And then Jalavad. I think I will actually take that myself. Okay, we're no getting no new people in the coalition, so do it. This one I'm gonna feed to them. To my vassal. They should not be anywhere close to having enough power to be like threatening or whatever. Or have liberty desire. They shouldn't have any liberty desire. Hey, we got mission filled. Conquer Malwa. Oh, nice. We just needed the, the state of Malwa. And we only had missing that one. Uh, I mean, there's literally no downside. Except um, we get more... Yeah, it's all upside. And we get discipline, too, for a few years. So, cool. Um, that actually gave us claims on the northern end now. Nagar and Jangladesh or whatever. Cool. Um, not bad. We can core this, right? Yes. Good. I figured we could. We have a vassal connecting us to it, so... Um, uh, not sure which ones are gonna fire first, so honestly, let's just come back to, like, the capital. <laughs> is this, this is hills? I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it, because we're last, it's been an issue in the past when we've not been able to defend all our stuff very well. Okay. Hmm. Okay, waiting on those cores. When do we want to integrate or annex our vassal? Not yet. We're gonna take some of Sin for them in their name. All right, well now that we eliminated three minor entities, what do we do next? All right, that becomes the issue, honestly, is like which one is our next easiest target? Probably Mawat. If I can get Vijayanagar to join, I think we'll be okay. Because they're out of Sirmer and Gujarat. And that would that war we could take a bunch of Gujarat land. Hmm. Age of Discovery is ending. Wait, did they change the trigger for that? Oh, no, this is the processor information. Sorry, I thought it was like it had to be colonialism to spawn. No, never mind. Does that put us over? Really? There's no max now? Huh. Didn't realize that was uh, changed that much. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, tell you what. I went way over on time on this episode, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, wrap this up here. So thanks for watching, guys. Please go ahead and leave a like and subscribe for more if you enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.